Hey guys, so today I'm going to do basically a unboxing and semi-review of the new Morphe times Jeffree Star palette. Um, I would have done this like a week ago, but Morphe decided to take their sweet time about delivering and they just delivered. Like for reals, I think this palette came out on the 13th. Today is the 22nd and they kept telling me well not they but like when I would check like shipping updates it said it was gonna come the 23rd so it's a day early but 10 days I'm used to I don't know maybe I'm privileged I have prime and like everything else I order just comes in like really quickly so like for example the mystery box from Jeffree Star I ordered it Friday and it came it was here by Monday so maybe that's it but maybe I'm just whining so far that's the only complaint I have for my rant about the whole situation. Um, I don't have any eyeshadow right now because since it's, it is an eyeshadow palette, I was thinking maybe, you know, I could do something with it. But since I haven't opened it yet, I haven't done anything with it. So it comes in a box like this. Um, it's just pretty, you know, it's just a box. Nothing special about it. And then you open it. Let's open it together. And that's how it looks. So there's bubble wrap and I guess it's bubble wrap like this. Honestly, I'm very excited. I only have one Morphe palette and it's like the 35M Boss. For reals, that is the only Morphe palette that I've ever been so drawn to. Um, I've The other ones just seem like normal palettes to me. But that one, for because of the green, I think that one really made me happy. But then this one came and I loved it. Like the colors in this are just so nice. So let's see. Let's see. Hopefully it came out in good conditions. And there's a great picture of Jeffrey himself right there. So let's see. Inside. This is how it comes in. With bubble wrap as well. Which is really nice. Okay, hold up, hold up. There's a little plastic thing. And this is what it looks like. Isn't it beautiful, guys? Like, for reals? It's so nice. There's actually a really big mirror, you guys. Um, and, yeah, no, it's so beautiful. Honestly, it looks almost more beautiful in real life than it does... Um, in the videos I've seen and in the picture, um, I don't know, I think it's really beautiful. So I'm just going to swatch them. Really excited for these three. Glam Rapids, Wake and Bake, and Nate, as you guys can guess. Um, green's my favorite color. And then I'm really excited for Drive Through 2. I hadn't seen it. It's so beautiful. Like, let me give you guys a close-up. So, so beautiful. The one on top right here, Millions, looks absolutely beautiful gorgeous too and then i am also very excited i'm very excited for wand noise that's this one right here also very very excited for this little square it's absolutely beautiful and that's mogul self-made boss angeles and pink fleet so let's see i'm just gonna swatch them in my hand all of them um so let's see i'm gonna start with the first row called Welcome back to my channel, Juan Noise. So his iconic uh, saying. So this is the first row. I hope you guys can see it right there. This is the first row. So it basically goes from this side to that. Welcome back to my channel, Wand Noise. Isn't it beautiful? It's absolutely gorgeous. Oh my lord, it's so gorgeous. But yeah, that's that. They're honestly really pretty. I don't know if the camera is showing them, but this one and this one are super sparkly. The other ones, oh, this one is too, I guess. Um, it's kind of like a metallic, but these are really shimmery. And then the other ones are just matte. They're beautiful, um, but they aren't really what's getting me all excited, except for that one noise color. Can't wait for the second row. I hope it's a lot better. So I'm going to go with the next uh, row. I'm just going to do it on my hand. I think it, it'll just be easier.
So this is the second row. Can you guys see it? This is Lynn 1985 Mo Mogul, Self Made, Dog Mom, and Honest Truth. So Honest Truth and Dog Mom are the ones on the bottom. Dog Mom is the one near my thumb, while Honest Truth is the one not near my thumb, I guess you could say. Something really weird happened. So when I was swatching Mo Mogul, um, it kind of jumped to the shade on top. I don't know why. So I just kind of dusted it off. But that was really weird. I've never had that happen. But yeah, so that's the second row. And the colors that I was excited for, these ones, did not disappoint. That's one swatch. Um, it's kind of powdery. But look how beautiful they are. It's absolutely beautiful and vibrant. I can't wear to wear that. And you know, I wasn't excited for Dog Mom at all. But I just, I love that shade. So they do stain a little. But you know, I'm not about to like go crazy over that. So now I'm going to go with the third row, designer label, Mr. Diva, Boss Angeles, Pink Fleet, Calabasas, and don't know her. This is the third row, and so far this has been my favorite. All of them are absolutely beautiful. Don't know her? Oh my god. Like, look at that color. You know, this color kind of reminds me of his pink lip emanation um, little packaging. It's exactly like that. Let me bring it. it. I have it right here. It's not exact, but it kind of just reminds me because it's pink and sparkly. But yeah, no, I absolutely love it. The two that I was really excited about, which is Boss Angeles and Pink Fleet, are beautiful. But overall, it's so far my favorite row. I feel like I would totally wear these. I do like my pinks and my reds um, and my oranges kind of thing. So I think this is an absolutely beautiful row. And now we're going to go to the fourth row. So it's Rolls With It, Millions, Girl, What's the Tea, Vroom Vroom, and Custom Rims. Oh my lord, that one's beautiful. So here's the fourth row, and I gotta tell you, look at those two middle shades on the top row right there. Aren't they to die for that? Girl and millions, like, are you joking me? Look at that. They're beautiful. Oh my god. Ugh, this reminds me of Halloween and New Year's Eve party, like, for reals gonna cover my face because this deserves it all oh, it's so good um you know like I had seen this color and I was like uh, I had seen this color and I was like uh you know they're normal shades but dang oh my god I did not have these shades in my collection at all I have not like all the palettes in the world but like it's absolutely beautiful I'm so excited and now we're gonna go to the last shade which I'm so sad about I wish I could just be swatching them all day. But dang, I don't even know what colors to put on my eyeballs right now. Like, for reals, y'all? It's, it's too much pressure because they're all so fucking beautiful. Now we're on to the last row. And we got Glam Rapids, Wake and Bake, Nate, Drive Through, Hi Dude, and the black one is Fast Lane. So there you go. Here you guys go. This is the last row. Um, the three that I was super excited about, Glam Rapids, Wake and Bake, and Nate. Um, oh, actually, and Drive Through too, no? Uh, they're beautiful. They really are. Um, and then the bottom two are nice, too. The reason I bought the other Morphe palette, the Boss Mood 35 or whatever, was because of a green shade similar to this um, This one right there. It's so hard in the camera, but Wake and Bake, so the second one. Um, this one. And, y'all, it didn't perform like this. Um, it's honestly really, really beautiful. My only complaint, like I said, is that shipping with Morphe takes so much time. I had heard people complain about shipping, but I thought that the reason they complained was because it 
you know, it was probably too expensive, but it just, it took forever. I don't know where the hell this thing came from, but for reals, it just took forever. I live in the San Fernando Valley, so basically I could have driven to Burbank and gone to the Morphe store and probably bought this, but I was lazy that day that this thing released and I just decided not to go and I was like, oh, whatever. I'll order it. It'll come here by Friday, by Saturday. No, lies, lies. I've had a week more than a week, so um, I don't know. By the time I upload this, everybody's probably uploaded a video about this, but what am I? Now you guys know, and like I said, I absolutely love it. I couldn't be more happy with this beautiful palette. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think about this. Um, or are you guys going to buy it, or are you guys just going to pass on it just because it's Morphe? Or what do you guys think? And thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.